In the past, we've talked about preparing for the upcoming spring calving season. Part of the preparation is to have some colostrum on hand to give to those high-risk calves. We want to make sure that they get the disease protection that they would need in order to survive and make it up to weaning time and the sale time next fall. Some of those high-risk calves may be those that were born in a difficult birth, took a long time for the delivery to take place, or they're born to a two-year-old heifer that doesn't look like she's going to have much milk to provide the colostrum that that calf needs. In either case, we want to be able to provide Best of all, natural colostrum, if we can, to that calf within the first six hours of life and then repeat it again 12 hours later. Colostrum may be obtained from, say, a, a neighboring dairy in your area. They would have uh, dairy cows freshening uh, pretty much around the year, so you might check with them to see if they would let you have or buy some colostrum from those cows. If you get colostrum from another operation, whether it be a dairy or another beef operation, I would want to know that that particular situation has never had Yoni's disease. That can be transferred to your operation uh, through colostrum, so keep that in mind. If natural colostrum is not available, then consider going to the local feed store and purchasing what's called colostrum replacer. Uh, this is something that you can purchase. They're reasonably expensive, but they can be worth it if you need it. A replacer is one that will have a minimum of 100 grams of immunoglobulin per dose. And that's important that you look on the label to make sure that that's the case. Colostrum replacers then can be used to give that calf that doesn't get enough colostrum from the mother and get them that start that they need to get the immunoglobulins in the bloodstream to give them some disease protection. Either way, we think it's important that you prepare for this, get ready for this upcoming calving season, and by having some colostrum or colostrum replacer on hand, perhaps you can save just a few more calves. Hey, we look forward to seeing you next week on Sunup's Cow-Calf Corner.